Today we'll be talking about the Z-perm. So Z-perms or Z-perms depending on where you're from are these right here. So these can be recognized by there being headlights on all four sides which means that the corners are solved and the edges are not solved. So here uh, the difference between this and the H-perm is that these are adjacent colors so orange and green are next to each other and then if we look on the other side red and blue they're next to each other so this is the adjacent edge swap so these two next to each other are swapped and these two on the other side next to each other they have to be swapped so in terms of algorithms there's actually two good ones for the Z perm uh, the first one I'm going to show is the one I actually use, so it goes like this. However, another way to do Z-perm is this algorithm. Final quick note about the algorithms is that if you use your alternate hands for M and U moves, then you can mirror these algorithms, which basically involves uh, changing U primes into U's or vice versa. Um, it saves you having to do those weird finger tricks for the U moves. So finally onto the AUFs. So you, if you use the first algorithm I shown, which is the one that starts off with an M2 U prime, then the AUF is uh, a U2, which means that uh, the orange headlights for this example, orange headlights are at the front, which actually means that after the algorithm, the red will be at the front. So we'll have to do a U2 after the algorithm. Uh, so like this. So a U2 at the end. So for the second algorithm that I shown, the one that starts with an M prime U prime, the AUF is slightly harder to tell. Um, from the algorithm, the AUF is a U move, but to recognize it is slightly more difficult. So the way I recognize it is that I look for the color in the middle. So in this case, blue is in the middle, but that's not the important color. The important one is the color opposite of blue, which in this case is green. So in this case, if I do the algorithm, green's the important color because green's, green's the color that will end up at the front. So in that case, if I do a U to match up green and green, that solves the cube. And so with that in mind, here's the algorithm with the AUF. So green ends up at the front, and I add a U move to solve the cube. So that's it for the Z-perm made easy. Hope you learned something, and thanks for watching.